Hi there, my name is Pradnesh. I'm a co-founder and CEO at Ultimate AI. We are the builders behind Data Pilot, which is an AI team made for data teams. Or if you have done DBT development before, you might have used our DBT Power User Extension in VS Code, which is usually popular. So in this session, I'm going to tell you more about what Data Pilot, which is an AI team made for data teams, can do for data engineers like accelerating DBT development tremendously or automating snowflake cost savings. Let's start with the vision behind the data pilot. You know, I'm sure you have been in this situation before or might be in this situation right now. There is always never ending backlog of projects. You know, and for certain projects, there is a zero additional budget for hiring. Our suggestion or recommendation to you is give these AI teammates to your teams, use it yourself to address the challenges, to make data work automated and accelerated. Now, if you look at the data work today, what's the data work that data engineers and analytics engineers do? One, create ELT pipelines. And for which tools get used Something like, you know, Airbyte for extract and load data or for transformations, DBT. For testing data, quality tests are written. Many data quality tools are out there. Our data gets documented. There are tools like data catalogs or sometimes people use in-house solutions. And with this macroeconomic environment today, a lot of teams are paying attention to saving costs in their data warehouse also. So this lot of work that's being done by data engineers and analytics engineers using the tools that are available. But still there are a bunch of frustrations. Number one, there is still a lot of time consuming and repetitive work. There are data and knowledge silos across the teams. For example, something simple as writing quality tests. You need a collaboration between business and data teams to figure out exactly which tests to write or it requires specialized knowledge. For example, not everybody in your organization is snowflake cost saving expert. How do you figure out in which way query can be written in the best way or warehouse configured to save on the cost? Our recommendation is give these AI teammates or have this common AI teammate layer to automate and accelerate as data pilot. Data Pilot is essentially a collection of AI agents which use LLM to accelerate the work. For example, we have an AI agent which can do transformation pipeline generation. We have an AI agent for quality test generation, auto documentation. I know very, very few people who enjoy writing data documentation, so AI can help there. Or we have an AI agent which can help with snowflake cost and performance improvements. And these AI agents are integrated in interfaces to tools that data engineers and analytics engineers use every day. Interfaces like IDEs, you know, like VS Code, CLI that can be integrated into Git CI CD workflows, or it can be available in Slack and browser interfaces as well. And this, all of this automation and acceleration is bringing in very quantifiable benefits to the data teams. For example, 20% faster DBT development, or you can have 15% or lower snowflake costs. Now let's dig deeper a little bit into that 20% faster DBT development. The first and foremost, we have made this data pilot or AI agents available as a VS Code extension. Our VS Code extension named DBT Power User is usually popular on VS Code Marketplace. It has been downloaded 94,000 times so far, used by hundreds of enterprises and thousands of weekly active users are benefiting from it. And if you check out the reviews, Reviews are, this is a work changing tool. So if you haven't used it already, it's a free and open source extension. I highly recommend just go to your VS Code Marketplace, download it and start using it for some of the agents we have around DBT. Data Pilot will help you 
automate and accelerate your DBT development by large margin. Whether you want to generate your DBT models in the first place, it can generate your DBT models from source file. Or if you have number of SQL transformations that you want to convert into DBT models, it can help you with that where it will automatically replace the references, et cetera, in that existing SQL. The next step after generating DBT model is testing DBT model. Data pilot can automatically recommend you the test that you should write for that particular DBT model. By utilizing your data profiles, your query history, and a bunch of other metadata. And not just it will give you the test that you should write, it will generate the code for it as well. Plus, it will enable you to see the actual SQL query that DBT model is going to execute. And it will produce the data results as well. You can take those data results, export those out, or do additional analysis on those using the widgets present in the VS Code extension. Now you have generated models, tested those models. The next step is generating talks. The fun part, very few people like it. So AI agents, can generate model and column descriptions for you automatically. And not just the generation, after generation, you can edit those and those can be saved in a formatted way in YAML automatically. So no more tabbing, make sure everything aligns correctly. The agent will automatically do that for you. And you know, like everything in life, nothing goes perfectly. Sometimes you have to troubleshoot those models. So the extension comes with a column lineage with impact analysis, as well as there is a DBT project health check, which can identify issues like you have DBT call, um, model columns that are not actually present in the databases, et cetera. I have been talking about the functionality that's available in VS Code extension, but if you are not a VS Code user, don't worry. A lot of the same functionality is available in our SaaS UI as well, which is available for free on www.ultimate.ai. Now we looked a little bit at accelerating DBT development. Let's look at the second area, which is saving a bunch of money in Snowflake costs, right? Why Snowflake is so expensive, right? It's because people misuse it. There are a bunch of bad queries written or there are unused tables. I know companies who run millions of queries within a week or have thousands of unused tables. And a lot of times business teams get blamed for it it's used by non-experts. You cannot expect everyone to be a snowflake expert. This is where AI agents can come in, help you automate and monitor things automatically. Now, when it comes to data pilot, it can identify the dollar sinkholes that you have in the form of these unused tables, which may be incurring high storage costs or even high ETL, ELT costs, it can identify those tables for you. Or it can identify problematic queries which have unused joins or bad filter conditions, you know, spillovers, et cetera. It can identify those insights for queries for you, as well as give your team's recommendations on how to fix those things. So now you don't need to be a Snowflake expert to sort of save costs on Snowflake. So these AI agents can enable that in SaaS UI, as well as by shifting lab right into your development workflows like IDEs, Git CI, CD, it can give those insights and recommendations as well. And the th third part, when it comes to Snowflake warehouses, it can obviously do cost spike detection, et cetera, but by analyzing that configurations of the warehouses and analyzing your workloads, it can give you insights and recommendations around warehouse configurations, which warehouse which you should use for which workload, et cetera, as well. And this overall intelligence and automation will help you net-net save a lot of money in your Snowflake cost also. Even though Data Pilot uses a lot of LLMs and advanced functionality, there are some rule-based things also. We are using only metadata to do all of this intelligence. So data and code stays in user environment. The solution also has a customer configurable security layer. And the third step is human is in the loop. It's not super automated for critical things. Human has to come in and need to approve critical step. 
So data pilot is the next wave that's coming to the data space as an AI team is to data teams. My suggestion is be part of this data pilot wave. Try it out. It's available for free. You can sign up at www.ultimate.ai. Thank you so much.